Hello and welcome to today's question of the day from IPMAT Indore 2024 QA MCQ section. Today's question is based on arithmetic and within arithmetic percentages. But it's not a very straightforward question that you just had to write the percentage or calculate the percentage. Here there was a small trick it was based on the concept wherein what kind of denominators or totals or base values could give you what kind of percentages. So let's look at the question. The smallest possible number of students in a class, if the girls in the class are less than 50%, but more than 48% is. Now when you read this question, you should understand that it's not a straightforward percentages question. Based on the total number you had to identify what kind of percentages are possible and among the options given what would be the smallest total that can give you a percentage between 50 to 48 percent. Alright, so the key here was that number of girls can only be an integer. Okay, so the number of girls upon the total into 100 percent is going to be less than 50% and greater than 48%. So the total has to be something. We can adjust the number of girls, but the total has to be something that can give us a percentage between 48 to 50%. Okay. So for example, yes, I know if I look at the numbers, if I take the total to be 100 and there are 49 girls, 49% is possible, right? So, 100 is definitely a, a you know, a, a possible answer. But the question was, what is the smallest such possible, you know, smallest possible number that can give us the, the required percentage, that is the percentage of girls being between 48 to 50 percent, okay. So, uh, I'm not going to check 200 at all because 100 in itself is sufficient to give me a percentage between 48 to 50 percent, right? Girls can be 49 out of 100. So, girls can be 49 percent, right? So, 200 is definitely eliminated. Now, uh, from, I'll, I'll use the options for this question. So, I'll, I'll check if 25 can give me a certain percentage, okay? And number of girls have to be around 50 percent only, right? But slightly less than 50 percent. Uh, half of 25 is 12.5. The integer just less than that is 12. So, if I calculate, if the girls are taken to be 12 out of 25, what is the percentage that we get? 12 out of 25, the percentage that you'll get would be 12 into 4, that is 48% exactly. But the number of girls had to be more than 48%. So, 25 can give me 48%. And at th if I take 13 girls, it will be more than 50%. But it can't give me a percentage which is between 48 and 50%. So option C is eliminated. Now I just have to check for option A. If option A can give me an answer, great. Otherwise, my answer would be option B. So option A is 27. Now in out of 27, I want a, the number of girls to be less than 50 but very close to 50. So 50% 50 of 27 is 13.5. The closest number of girls that I can take to it is 13. So I'll just calculate the percentage value of 13 out of 27. If that number is between 48 to 50, then answer is 27. Otherwise, my answer would be 100 only. So if I do this calculation into 100%, so 13 into 100, 1300 divided by 27%. And you do that calculation, 27 goes, 27 goes 5 times in 135. So in 130, it goes four times and in 134 times so the remainder is 22 the next number is 220 in 220 27 goes four times in 108 so eight times in 216 so in 216 it goes eight times so the remainder is four four it does not go any uh, zero times so i'll put a decimal point and make it 40 in 40 it goes once so, this is approximately coming out to be 48.1%. It is greater than 48% and less than 50%. So, the total of 27 students is able to give me a percentage of girls which is between 48 and 50. Therefore, my answer to the question is option A.
So although this question was not so direct in terms of percentage calculation, but because the numbers were such that you wanted the percentage to be around 50%, you could have easily tested for each of the options that were given to you, whether you will be able to achieve a percentage in the given range or not by taking the nearest integer to 50% or the integer just less than 50%. So we tested for 25 and we tested for 27. For 25 it was not possible so therefore it got eliminated. But for 27 we were able to get a percentage which was in the given range and hence the answer to the question is 27 that is option A. I would rate this question as a type A question that you could have done within 2 minutes even in your first go. Okay. So I hope this video has helped you understand the solution of this question and I wish you all the best in your IPMAT preparation. Stay tuned to our channel for more such videos.